I was listening to one of my favorite podcasts today, and the guest was a woman who was talking about the importance of words in language in our speeches. She made this statement. I wish the word but could be eliminated from the English language. It's such a negative word. When it comes to everyday conversation, I couldn't agree more. It negates everything you've said to someone earlier. With that said, the most important word is in storytelling is the word but, or a variation of it. However, on the other hand, yet. Why? Because it introduces conflict. Most speeches and stories I hear are full of information that are connected by the word and. This person was here and then did this and this happened and that happened and that is boring. We need conflict as soon as possible and the word but introduces it. My favorite example of this is the princess who met the prince. They fell in love, they got married and lived happily ever after. That's boring. That's why children fall asleep at night when they hear that. It doesn't become a story until we introduce the contradiction with the word but princess meets the handsome prince they fall in love they get married they live happily ever after but then comes the abduction when you hear that immediately your brain says well what happened who got abducted did the person survive did they rescue all these questions come up that's the introduction of conflict which creates an emotional bond with the listener so yes in your everyday conversation try to avoid use of the word but however in stories, we have to use it if we want to connect with the audience emotionally. In the next video, you'll hear about the importance of dialogue in your story.